Okay, let's see how we can create spring rigging in Maya 2024. Our final result will be just like this one. See? So let's get started. Go to create polygon primitives, take a helix, type height 14, wide 4, coil 6, translate y type here 7, rename this one as 0, delete history, freeze transformation. Go to edge selection mode, double click on this edge, modify, convert, polygon edge to curve, open the option box, edit, reset the setting. Click convert, object mode, type scale x, y, z, 0.8, scale y, type here 1, rename this one as carp, delete history, freeze transformation, deselect all, go to deform, wire, first select the geo, press enter, then select the carp, press enter. Now with carp selected, try to scale it along y axis select the geo wire drop of distance try to increase it make it 3 select the curve scale y type here 1 now hide your geometry select your curve go to deform click lattice t division type here 3 FFD1 all type 2 now go to front view and modeling menu to rigging menu split on create joint press X to turn on snap to grid option and create one joint here and duplicate the joint three times and rename them as upper lower and mid select the upper joint press X to turn on snap to grid option and move it here Type translate y value to 14. Select the upper joint and the lower joint and then middle joint. Go to constrain. Click point constrain. Again go to constrain. Click remove target. Go to perspective view and see the effect. Now select this three joint. Control select the FFD1 lattice. Go to skin. Click bind skin. Now select your lattice. Go to vertex selection mode. Select this vertex. Go to Windows, General Editor, Open Connection edit, Component Editor. For upper joint, type here 1. Select these vertices. For middle joint, type here 1. Select the lower vertices and type here 1. Now close this one. Go to Object Mode. Go to Carbon Surfaces. Take a NARP circle and scale it as shown. Ctrl plus D to duplicate it three times and rename them as upper, lower and mid. Now select them all. Delete history, freeze transformation. Select the upper controller, press Ctrl plus Z to create a group and, and rename the group as upper controller group. Do the same for the other two. And hide your lattice. And also your curve. Select the upper controller group. Snap it to the upper joint as shown. Middle controller group, snap it to the middle joint. Lower controller group, snap it to the lower joint. Now unhide your geometry and curve. Select the upper controller. Control select the upper joint. Go to constraint, open parent constraint option. Edit, reset the setting. Turn off maintain offset, click apply. Do the same for the other two joint. Now select the middle controller. Try to move it and see the effect. Select the FFD1 lattice. Go down FFD1. Make the local influence value to 3. Select the middle controller. Make the translate value to 0. Now select the upper controller, go to Windows, General Editor, Open Connection Editor, click Reload to Left, 
upper joint reload right and connect scale x to scale x y to y g to g do the same for the other two controller and joint now close this one now select your upper controller try to move and see see the spring rigging effect in this process you can create a spring rig in maya 2024 thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe my channel